Imagine a world where prosthetic limbs learn your habits, where paralyzed individuals control robots with their thoughts, where AI doesn't just live in code, it pulses through your veins, rewires your brain, and merges with your DNA. This AI-powered limb doesn't just move as it anticipates. Neuralink's brain chips, they're not sci-fi. They're decoding your neurons, turning minds into remote controls for reality. And China's new robot? It's alive. But here's the real question. When AI bleeds into your brain, who are you anymore? To start with, the University of Alberta's research team progresses with a significant leap forward in human augmentation with their development of the Bento Arm, an AI-powered prosthetic limb which smoothly converts the user's neural and muscular signals to create seamless and natural movements that are highly responsive. Harnessing a sophisticated network of high-resolution sensors, including electromyography EMG sensors, inertial measurement units IMUs, and tactile sensors, the bento arm senses even the most subtle signals from the limb, translating them into precise motor commands through advanced deep learning algorithms. These algorithms, trained on expansive datasets representing a wide range of natural human motions, not only predict intended movements with startling accuracy, but also adapt in real time to the user and their varying environmental conditions. By 2031, the market for such algorithms is projected to reach 3.45 billion, and this is driven largely by AI and advanced analytics applications. Also, recent demonstrations at the 2024 Biomedical Engineering Conference showcase the device's capabilities in carrying out complex tasks, such as delicately grasping fragile objects. It can also dynamically adjust grip strength based on continuous tactile feedback and transition flawlessly between activities, from routine tasks like picking up a cup to more demanding tasks requiring fine motor control. Furthermore, repetitive updates to the machine learning models have enabled the bento arm to learn and recalibrate its responses over time. This leads to a more intuitive user experience that reduces the learning curve for new users. Collaborations with neurorehabilitation centers have also provided valuable insights into integrating the prosthetic with wearable smart devices, enhancing remote monitoring and performance tuning, thus paving the way for personalized prosthetic care. This groundbreaking innovation is not only a transformative step towards merging human physiology with advanced robotics, but also promises a future where enhanced prosthetics could restore lost body functions and drastically improve the quality of life for amputees worldwide. For context, traditional rehabilitation typically takes about 12 months to reach 85% proficiency, but with AI-enhanced prosthetics, patients are reaching 95% proficiency in about six months. This acceleration comes from the system's ability to learn and adapt to each of the user's unique patterns and needs. In January 2025, scientists at the University of Cambridge announced groundbreaking developments in implantable muscle sensors, allowing paralyzed individuals to control prosthetic limbs flawlessly. This innovative technology harnesses AI-powered neural decoding to interpret muscle signals. Tiny sensors are implanted in the muscles to detect neural signals, which transmit to a processor that uses AI to decode the signals and determine the intended movement. The decoded signals transmit to the prosthetic limb, which responds accordingly, and thereby allows individuals to control the limb with their thoughts. With real-time feedback and adjustment, individuals refine their control and dexterity, regaining motor function and independence. Additionally, Neuralink, a technology founded in 2016 by Elon Musk, attempts to create brain implants in humans. The company is working on effectively merging, integrating the human brain with AI, starting with the development of implantable brain-machine interfaces, BMIs. Neuralink's brain implants feature tiny chips with 1,024 electrodes that read neural signals and allow people to control devices with their thoughts. This enables humans to effectively merge with AI and adds to their cognitive abilities and sensory experiences. That means humans will be able to upload knowledge, skills, and even emotions directly into their brains, redefining the boundaries of human intelligence and capabilities with such technology.
Neuralink's brain implants establish a direct, high-bandwidth communication link between the human brain and external computing devices. These implants then utilize ultra-thin, flexible electrode threads that are delicately inserted into the brain and capture thousands of neuronal signals with unmatched precision. Recent advancements focus on reducing the invasiveness of the implantation procedure. State-of-the-art robotic systems now ensure that these electrodes are placed with surgical accuracy, which in turn reduces trauma to neural tissue and enhances long-term biocompatibility. Recent preclinical studies show promising results of the implants by decoding complex neural activity patterns. As a result, users can control digital devices, restore motor functions in paralyzed individuals, and even compensate for cognitive impairments. Also, merging sophisticated AI algorithms helps to translate the neural data into commands that perform actions and paves the way for applications in neurorehabilitation and beyond. Although Neuralink navigates through regulatory hurdles and ethical debates, the constant hardware and software improvements signal a future where the boundary between biological and artificial intelligence is increasingly blurred. It also opens up new transformative possibilities for medical treatments and human enhancement. Furthermore, Synchron's Stentrode device represents a groundbreaking advancement in neural intelligence because it offers a minimally invasive alternative to the typical brain implants. Using a catheter to get through the vascular system, the stentrode is guided to a blood vessel next to the brain's motor cortex, and its mesh-like electrode array expands to closely contact neural tissue. It's innovatively designed to allow the device to capture and interpret the brain's electrical signals without needing open brain surgery. For instance, a patient of a recent clinical trial with severe paralysis successfully used the stentrode to control digital interfaces and interact with assistive technologies. This demonstrates its ability to restore lost functions, significantly improving life quality. Since the stentrode eliminates the risks associated with craniotomy and leverages advanced data processing techniques, it paves the way for more intuitive, safer, and accessible brain-machine communication systems. Aside from its unique implantation method, advancements in the stentrode focus on improving both biocompatibility and signal quality. Enhanced materials and design modifications reduce the risk of inflammation and blood clot formation, which are common concerns with vascular implants. Additionally, the device features wireless data transmission capabilities, which allows continuous and seamless monitoring of neural signals without the need for external wiring. Integrating bidirectional communication is also in the works, where future improvements of the stentrode record brain activity and also deliver targeted electrical stimulation. Engineered Art's creation of Amica, a humanoid robot, was designed as a platform for AI research and human interaction applications. Launched in January 2022, Amica focuses on human-like expressions and facial movements. It distinguishes itself with its very human-like facial expressions and fluid body movements, and it tests the boundaries of what is possible in social robotics. Amica's versatile platform for AI research and human-robot interaction applications continues to amaze the tech world. Utilizing cutting-edge motion control and actuation systems, Amica displays subtle, context-aware expressions mimicking human emotions as well as creating an engaging and intuitive interface for users. Its open architecture further enables the integration of custom AI modules by researchers and developers and experimentation with innovative interaction paradigms. Exploring a wide array of applications from customer service and education to healthcare and entertainment, Demonstrations highlight Amica's ability to interpret and respond to complex human gestures and dialogue. It showcases not only its technical prowess, but also its redefinition of the future of human-robot collaboration. So far, we've talked about AI-human hybrids, but what about AI insects? Robots powered by insect brains could be used on Mars in the near future. These insect-brained robots represent an innovative leap in robotics by emulating the compact yet highly efficient neural architectures found in insects. Researchers are inspired by the way these tiny creatures process sensory information and make rapid decisions with minimal computational power, qualities that are crucial for exploring challenging environments like Mars. The concept involves designing robotic systems with decentralized control and energy-efficient processing, enabling them to quickly adapt to unpredictable terrains and adverse conditions. For instance, 
These robots could work in coordinated swarms, each unit contributing to a collective intelligence that enhances overall performance in navigation, obstacle avoidance, and data collection. Their minimal power requirements and robust design make them ideal for the harsh Martian landscape, where extreme temperatures, dust storms, and radiation pose significant challenges. By leveraging biomimetic principles, insect-brained robots could transform extraterrestrial exploration, offering a scalable and resilient alternative to traditional energy-intensive rovers and opening up new possibilities for in-depth scientific research on Mars. In a similar fashion, China stuns with their new AI robot bringing a new take to the AI humanoids with their brain-on-a-chip research. Instead of building the average robot with a silicon brain, they manufactured a brain made from actual living cells, thus crossing a line once believed to be uncrossable with a partially biological brain, essentially redefining the very essence of artificial intelligence. To paint a clearer picture, the robot, brain on a chip, relies on traditional computing circuits. These researchers grow extremely tiny brain cells from stem cells, attempting to mimic the design of a human brain. They then transplant such cells into a machine, thereby creating a robot that learns and adapts like a living creature. The robot experiences things and evolves based on what it learns, making it closer to how human brains work than any other humanoid AI seen before. Besides the advancements in prosthetics and direct motor control, a new path in the race for the first AI-human hybrid emerges in the realm of cognitive augmentation. A promising approach involves the development of a digital exocortex, a wearable or implantable device that functions as an extension of the human brain. Leveraging non-invasive neuroimaging techniques and state-of-the-art machine learning algorithms, these systems decode neural activity related to memory, decision-making, and creative problem-solving. Besides, preliminary studies show that subjects using exocortex prototypes display measurable improvements in complex task performance, which suggest that AI effectively supplements natural neural functions and enhances cognitive capabilities. In parallel, investigations into technologies like neural dust are underway to establish seamless live dialogue between the brain and external AI systems. Neural dust consists of ultra-miniaturized wireless sensors that are implanted near neural tissue to capture high-fidelity electrical signals. These signals enable a constant feedback loop that personalizes cognitive enhancement. This integration of biological and artificial intelligence opens up the possibility of a hybrid system where the brain's in-depth functions are aided by continuous AI-driven support, potentially revolutionizing fields such as education, mental health, and beyond. These technologies mark a significant step toward blurring the line between human cognition and artificial augmentation. Stay skeptical, stay curious, and remember, the future doesn't just happen. We build it.